Hey guys, welcome to the top three models for January 2018 and this is going to be in a slightly different format. I'm not really going to list in the video each of these assets because there's an awful lot of assets for this month and we've had some sort of slower months before this. So I'm just going to reel through all the different models that you could possibly look out for in this month and you should check all these out. So like I said, I'm just going to reel all these off. So the first one I'm going to show is the Horror Axe and this is a real, a quite a realistic looking axe model with sort of blooded um, hilt or whatever we might call it fairly low poly with about 400 polygons and with up to 2k textures and the second one is called druid tome and this is a low poly pbr model about 2400 triangles and it includes your normal pbr setup and it's quite a nice little i don't know sort of metallic looking old style book and it might be suitable for any fantasy rpg style game and the next one is the furniture pack number one and it includes a selection of furniture from a well-known Swedish star and they're based on real size models. It comes with 11 models, 35 prefabs and 35 different materials. So there's a whole selection of cabinets, chairs, um, desks, anything that you might want might be here for you. The next one is, I won't try and pronounce the name, but it's a statue of a Greek sort of sculpture with three LODs, 4K textures, and varying levels of triangle counts as you go down. And the next one is an asset called Antique Binoculars, and as it suggests, it's another great PBR little asset with about 2,700 triangles with 2K PBR textures, and it's just a more, maybe of a more historical themed game where you might have this in a stocking for a museum or you might even use it if it was something as a sort of gameplay mechanic to your game. Again, while we're following the theme, this is called Space Spacecraft Zero, and it's another really cool PBR related asset with 4K textures, about 2,100 triangles, and it's quite a cool looking spacecraft if you're making a space adventure game or something along those lines. And the next one is something called Axe Slicer, and again, comes with one 2K by 2K PBR texture set with, an, uh, um, with a material and it's really low poly about 644 triangles and you can see the wireframe down here so it's fairly optimized and you could sue any style whether that be your RPG, MMO or a sort of fantasy styled game. The next one is called the Polygon Desert Pack and it's a pack which can include various prefabs and 12 themed models in a sort of polygonal style with four desert plants and eight desert stones. I think this next one is a nice one because it's called the Winter Zone Mini. It includes a variety of meshes for terrains which are suitable for the unity with including the ground texture, weather effects, audio, and all things for the terrains that are involved. And it includes two meshes with 100 times 100 with 4K and 16K tries for each with the diffuser normal maps and it's got a quite a nice looking visual style. It looks quite high quality when you look at it from here and you could imagine these in sort of a fantasy game. You could even see it in something like Skyrim. And this next one is called Translucent Crystals and I think this is an actual, a really nice one that you would see as sort of maybe a paid asset. It's a fully PBR magic crystal with a custom translucent shader and you can use them in any game whether it be stylized or realistic and it comes with a variety of colors and I think they have a really really extremely high quality so you could use the shader on other things not just crystals but this works just really nice and I think it could suit any style of RPG or something where you might have magic crystals to decorate a scene or even if you used it on other props and other things if you were looking to maybe create a sci-fi game it could be suitable for that. And the next one is picture frames with photos and it's a collection of 10 wall frames with photographs and it's friendly for mobile perfectly as it suggests a bunch of photo frames with photos so you can go crazy with those. And the next one is the Sci-Fi Rifle Low Poly, and it's a low poly looking Sci-Fi Rifle about, about 3,000 triangles, and it comes with PBR related 2K textures, so again, this is just one by itself, it's called the Pine Tree Smashy Craft Series, and there's a few of these on the store, and there's just a bunch of different sort of stylized trees, vegetations, and things like that in this particular style, from a slightly larger set. But if you're looking to have this style, you might want to look at that pack or just help take a look at the, some of the free ones on this month. Another nice one is called the Cutlery Silverware PBR. And this is five separate objects, which include a knife, spoon, table fork, and 
uh, various metal and plastic things with PBR textures up to 2k with all the things that you expect and fairly low poly considering the shapes that are there. And the next one is the PBR old cabinet and we seem to be having a hell of a lot of PBR stuff but it's just great that, that we see all these for free. Is going to be an old cabinet with doors that open and close. It includes 2k PBR textures and it looks quite a nice um, styled cabinet. The next one is the cigarette lighter PBR and this includes four separate objects with the lighter body, the flint wheel, the fuel adjuster and the lever there and it inclu also includes PBR textures up to 2k so this might be one to dot around in your scene. And the next one is the free low poly desert pack and this is a, a low poly pack which is to create a low poly desert environment which all assets include poly counts between 16 and uh, 388 tries. It has nine types of assets with two variations on the color with nine flat colors and nine with mixed colors and they're all prefabbed and ready to go and if you're looking for again from some of these packs that you've seen these could sort of combine together and make a sort of deserty western style things with the vegetation the plants and the sort of little assets that you have here and last but not least is the free island collection and which is from the sort of triple a island environments and it's a highly detailed 2.5 kilometer by 2.5 kilometer terrain with realistic glass grass textures up to 2k with a high quality terrain textures and a really nice sky box that comes with it. The water is not included in this package but you can find it with a link here so you can see from various screenshots it's quite a large um, high quality looking terrain with all the textures included so again if you're looking for something for you know to spruce up your terrains this might be a good way to learn new things and take it to the next level. So this was just me throwing the assets out at you this week and it's a crazy month really for the amount of content that people have been putting out for free and I'm always month on month really surprised so make sure to check all these out and sort of give a thumbs up to all the developers who create them so again I'll leave a link in the description so you can check these out thanks very much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe cheers